Breaking news update. The hunt is on for a violent serial rapist from Lauderdale County who escaped from an Alabama prison. Corey Davies is serving a life sentence for a string of sexual assaults where he tied up one victim, repeatedly raped her, and sexually tortured her. He escaped the St. Clair Correctional Facility yesterday. Thanks for watching this afternoon. I'm Greg Privet. Dan Schaefer has the evening off. And I'm Melissa Martin. Right now, we want to get right to Way 31's Brecken Terry, who is in Lauderdale County. Brecken, earlier today, local, state, federal agents thought there was a possible sighting of Davis this afternoon. Can you bring us up to date with exactly what we know right now in this investigation? Well, we know around 10 o'clock this morning there was a reported carjacking on County Road 100 in Lauderdale County. Uh, that is right close to the Tennessee state line. Officials tell us that it could be Davis, but they do not have an official sighting of him here in the Shoals. Now, the U.S. Marshals, along with the Department of Corrections hounds, combed the area for the carjacker. Officials tell us the victim stated it was a white man wearing all white, which would be what Davis uh, could be wearing. Lauderdale County Sheriff's investigators, along with Florence Police, were also on scene searching for this individual. Now, Davis, on the other hand, is extremely dangerous and known to steal cars as well as cross-dress. Authorities are urging people in the Shoals to be vigilant because Davis still has connections here. Now, Davis also has family in Florida. Uh, investigators with the Lauderdale County Sheriff's Office actually tell me prior to his 2016 uh, serial rapist arrest and conviction, um, they were actually searching for him in a case and found him in Florida because he has family down there. Live in Florence, Breck and Terry, Way 31 News.